Good morning and welcome to your Daily Sparks. You know, I heard recently of a church where the new pastor called one of his old church leaders of the congregation to lead the church in prayer. And the church leader got up in the pulpit and respectfully and very solemnly said, Lord, I hate buttermilk. The pastor opened one eye and wondered where he was going with this prayer. Then the, the, the church leader loudly proclaimed, Lord, I hate lard. Now the pastor was worried. He thought, what have I let loose here of a Sunday morning? Then the church leader prayed on and he said, and Lord, you know, I don't care much for raw white flour. And the pastor thought, man, I've got to stop this. He he was about to get up and stop this prayer because it was weird and out of control. But then the church leader said this, but when Lord, when you mix them all up together and bake them, it makes biscuits and I love fresh biscuits. So he said, so Lord, when things come up that we don't like, when life gets hard, when we just don't understand what you are saying to us, we just need to relax and wait until you're done mixing and probably baking something that's even better than biscuits. And we know, he went on to say, that God causes all things to work for good for those who love him. Uh, Those who have been called according to his purpose. That's Romans 8, 28. So we may not always know exactly what's going on. We may not understand the hardship and difficulties we face. But I'll tell you what, you might not like buttermilk or lard or plain white flour, but when you put them together and allow God to mix and bake it, you'll get beautiful fresh biscuits. God bless you. Have a biscuity day today. Allow him to mold and shape your life and trust him. Even if you don't like the individual ingredients, the end result is worth it. We'll see you tomorrow on Sparks.